Hi, Cool Beer. My name is Daphne. I'm one of the essay correctors here at IELTSpodcast.com. Thank you for getting involved with us on the course. Lovely to have you with us. And we're going to be working together on your corrections. So I've put the titles in here. If you could always include the titles, that would be great, because then we can just refer back to them if we need to. So enjoyable activities in schools have evoked a heated debate in society about its importance. Uh, okay, I would turn this sentence around, actually. The importance of enjoyable activities have evoked a heated debate in society. For me, that's more logical. So I would start with the importance of. Yeah, it's almost like you've inverted the sentence, but it, I probably wouldn't do it here. The importance and priority, maybe, of including um, enjoyable activities in schools have evoked heated debate in society. Okay? Uh, fine. That's a good start there. Really good. Rudimentary ideology suggests are all there, that educational centres keep only aim to educate people, whereas contemporary ideas allow them to be reasonably entertaining. Okay, let's just go back to rudimentary ideology suggests that educational centres should, you're kind of recommending, keep their only aim, only aim to educate people. Now, people Let's be more specific here. Students, children and students, maybe. Whereas contemporary ideas uh, maybe in, uh, encourage and allow them to be reasonably entertaining. Now, very important. We need to explain what we mean. So I would prefer you to actually avoid this word, partly because it's in the title. So you need to show your own vocabulary. So allow them to be more interesting. Sorry. Hang on. Uh, allow them to be more, uh, more interesting and stimulating. So allow them to be more interesting and stimulating. Then we've included nice adjectives in there. We're showing good language. This essay will demonstrate. Okay, that's fine. Good. Um, but we do need your opinion. So ideally, I quite like your opinion in the intro as well as in the conclusion. Uh, to embark upon a little bit formal that um, to begin with, or it is agreed that that. Amusement keeps an individual mentally sound through healing mental exhaustion that continued study causes, that are that continued academic, let's be specific, uh, academic study in school, be really specific for this school's causes. Interesting. Apart from benefiting psychologically, entertainment, so. You could, you need to be more specific here, including sport or drama classes. So broaden this out. Explain to me what you mean. Also, enhances academic performance as a fresh mind learns more quickly and effectively compared to an exhausted. Really good argument there. For instance, a study by Oxford, it's not the Oxford, it's just Oxford, there's only one, revealed that children, no, this is students, definitely not children, Oxford Uni is students who take part in outdoor games and theatre, got better grades. Well, you wouldn't use got, I would use achieved better grades than others, good. Therefore, it's essential to have adequate enjoyable events um, in education uh, institutes. Good paragraph, very nice, well done. On the other hand, so watch out with... If you have on the other hand, you should have on one hand. It is often blamed that some schools have crossed the limit in organising. Okay, It's often blamed that. That doesn't work. It's often suggested that. It's often argued that. So it's suggested or argued. You can't blame that. That some schools have crossed the limit in organising non-educational events which have negative implications on academic results because... 
Um, now, rather than lots more it is it, it, let's get a noun in here. Because of, so I'm going to go because of the shifting focus way from studies. You don't need to repeat students. We know you're talking about students. Okay, so just go away from studies. And so you don't need the the swipe but because of the shifting focus gone straight into that now away from studies furthermore parents um, have to pay or are obliged to pay substantial charges to prepare their young ones fees we would say it's fees in the school context not charges to prepare their young ones who want to participate in oh extra charges then extra fees or subscriptions Use as many words as you can to prepare their young ones or to enroll would be the, a good word there um, if you want to participate uh, in these activities. Good. For example, a study by the Delhi government revealed that fun related activities, so fun related, yeah, okay, cost 25% more to parents and took, so cost and took. There, 20% of the total school hours. For these reasons, of emphasis on holding amusing events. Um, yes, in as X. Curricular activities could harm. Um, now, I'm really keen on these modal verbs. Could. Could, might, and may. You'll hear me talking about these a lot. Could harm education. Could harm um, an educational atmosphere. Seriously. Could seriously harm. So your adverb needs to come before your verb in here. Yeah. But nice, again, very nice point, especially on the fees. That's very interesting. To conclude, uh, now you need your opinion. I believe that. A right balance is paramount as a form of protection site so protects uh, young stirs from psychological issues along with developing uh, the horizons of mind. Uh, and I would stop there. Okay? Don't worry about that. End with a strong thing. I believe that. And then assume, this would be a good conclusion, assuming you do believe it's okay. Uh, but a good start there. Well done. Really nice. Clear, clear arguments. Uh, so here we go. Second one. Doing an enjoyable activ activity with a child. Um, can develop better skills and more creativity. To what extent do you agree? So how much do you agree? So again, we need your opinion in here and in the conclusion. How beneficial is relaxing activities as compared to conventional learning to develop skills in a child? Is an increasingly debatable issue due to the diversion of opinions. It's a little bit round in a circle, this. Um, it's this word how, which is not a great way to start. Um, so I would say the benefits of encouraging now this is a slightly different essay this is doing an activity with a young child yeah uh, encouraging uh relaxing so this is the word i'm also not sure about uh, encouraging diverse activities as compared to conventional learning so it's not learning it's just reading a book yeah so be very careful you understand the question as compared to sitting uh reading book yeah um to develop skills then you'd come in here to develop skills in a child is increasingly debatable issue yeah i don't think you need that um critical issue Lily among parents. Okay, so who would be talking about this? This group of people would be particularly talking about it. Okay, a lot of more modern analysts. So, analysts maybe, but also teachers, yeah, education professionals, 
we need to analysts, I'm thinking of finance analysts, probably not, um, but good idea to think about who the people might be. Strongly believe schooling is overweighted by entertaining. Now, uh, be careful because I'm really not talking about schools. So don't write me the same essay as the other one. Yeah, this is doing an activity with a child. It could be going to the park, going to a museum, playing football. Okay, be careful you are going to answer the right question. Carefully probe the matter. Mm, maybe not. I think I just stick with something more simple. We'll discuss the key issues. Okay, but remember your opinion needs to come in here as well. Firstly, entertaining problems are inextricably intertwined with increasing level of understanding in a child through teaching him vital historical memories and cultural values in the artistic form. Okay. I mean, I think given what I've said about we need to sort of re re like make sure we're on the right question. So um including children in entertaining programs. Um which so and you might need to say such as visiting historical locations um are uh, inextricably good intertwined with an increasing level of understanding in a child through teaching him vital historical moments and cultural values in an artistic uh, visual form. Okay, it's a nice sentence. It's a little bit complicated sometimes how you're approaching your sentence. Sometimes it's okay just to be more direct. It's easier for the examiner to understand and you can add value in your grammar. For example, a study by Cambridge, so again just Cambridge, revealed that students learn more accurately. So this really has to be young children, it is a very different essay, more accurately uh, than attending a lecture for this pursuit. By oh, watching your drama, sorry, yeah, okay, good. Apart from this, activities such as games and sport also keep children physically fit. So I wouldn't feel adequately, physically and mentally you could have fit. Uh, not except for, uh, I would go especially for, that's what you're looking for. Especially in terms of developing the art. Good, really nice. Okay, good point there. Well done. Uh, that's a little bit too casual. So you could, because um, you've given your example, you could say thus or therefore. Yeah, it can be suggested that or concluded that. Yeah. Uh, involvement in a wide range of activities is very valuable. Uh, so conversely, reading is important for children. I get this idea about young children to know about a topic thoroughly in a scientific matter. Okay, so mm -hmm, I'm thinking young children, okay, really, really read the question. So think about little children reading a picture book or reading a fiction book, that kind of thing. Or learning about the world from looking at pictures in an atlas, this sort of thing. So what you've written is okay, but you're not answering the right question. So just be cautious on that. Um, Encourages teenagers to research and find answers to their doubts independently, which is a very good point. So you could say once the habit, the children who develop a good habit when they're young, become more successful in school because they've done this. So good school grades are essential to pursuing. Either is okay actually. Further education is a reputed place because academic ability is measured through obtained marks. Okay. Yes, I mean, I think you need to, this is fine, but you need to make the point of starting young, okay, and it really, you're comparing the two things. For example, so definitely not that example, for me that is the wrong idea. Okay, you need to really get this back to young children. Don't worry. To conclude, then opinion again here. Enjoyable programs can teach an artistic way about the past, as well as make an adolescent. So, I'd go into a youngster, quite a useful word here. Strong psychologically and physically, what are scholarly ways uh, inspire them to be researchers and have a higher 
Okay, now you can't, um, <laughs> sorry, for the sake of IELTS, you cannot agree with both. Okay, it is really important, go back to the question, to what extent do you agree? Yeah, how much do you agree with this? So you've got to agree or disagree. It doesn't matter what you really think, they don't know. Yeah, but really, in your opinion, I strongly believe that this is more important than that. Okay, um, so really well done. Good start here. There's lots of great stuff in your writing. Um, hopefully, you will find the next one when we have the template. Um, really helpful in order to get the coherence going, uh, but you've done a great start. Well done.